Hi there kit fans, it's Louise with you today on behalf of Kitaholic Kits and I am sharing a new 12 by 12 scrapbook layout created using the February 2021 kit. Now what I wanted to do with this layout is um, focus on a cut file. Now look, I'm going to be honest, I'm not a huge cut file person but when I do use them I go big. So I've cut this um, selfie fun title which is exclusive for February. Um, now I'm going to make it big. <laughs> I wanted a big title. So you can see that I've cut it basically on an A4 white piece of card and I've pulled all the backing bits off and I'm deciding what I'm going to back it with. Now this was challenging because there are so many gorgeous papers and I knew because I was creating a layout of myself with Fearless Leader at Retreat. So from 2020 Brabi Island Retreat, if you haven't heard about it, get on board. You really don't want to miss out on um, attending a retreat because they are so much fun and just have a ball. So this is um, a more feminine photo to me because it's got us girls in it. I can go a little bit more feminine. So I've um, used lots of pinks and butterflies and florals. I'm adding a little bit of backing to my um, photo there just to help lift it out of that background. It was getting a little bit lost with all the pink and the big selfie fun title. So I used black to help um, raise that a little bit. And then I've mounted everything up on cardboard to give it some dimension. Now I toyed with the idea, do I leave it plain? Because I quite like the layout with the um, just the plain pink background. But I also thought, no, it needed just a little hit of something. So I'm using the white linen um, spray that we got with the mixed media kit and I'm creating a little bit of interest in the background. Now I've got to be crazy with the spray and it's at this point where I think okay I need to get my um, heat gun out and start to dry a little bit of this off but I end up I mop quite a bit of it up um, which I know is very wasteful but eh, scrapbooking what can you do um, and I actually um, like the color a lot better because it's a lot more subtle and you can still get that glorious shimmer it dries beautifully and once you put the cut file and the layers across the top it's just perfect so if I'd left it dark it would have been way too much but it's just um, muting that background a little bit and adding that little bit of extra fun. Now, a little um, tip from me with these um, Heidi Swap stickers is that they are quite clear and see-through. So I'm going to pop them up on some white cardboard just to help them not blend in with where I want to put them, which is across the top left of that photo. So um, I am going to peel one of the stickers off and I'm then going to mount it onto some white. You can see there straight away that looks so much better. You can actually read what the sticker says without it getting lost in the photo. So peeling off the old sticker and putting a new white background one in its place. And, you know, in terms of this layout, I'm just going to add my journaling with the who, what, when, where and stick everything down. And then this layout is complete. So I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, make sure you have hit that little subscribe button.